You know Alec, my fiance. <laughs> YouTube videos for many years now about my life, my career in marketing, and that kind of stuff. It's been a while since I last posted a vlog, like always. I really need help. Yeah, I have been super busy like this whole year pretty much. It's currently May, and I've been nonstop traveling and doing stuff since like March. earlier this year like these past couple months I've been traveling a lot for work um, which is great it's been super fun I am packing for my trip tomorrow I made it to Chicago <laughs> I am currently in Pasadena right now for a work event that we're doing in LA. <laughs> now I'm back home and I've just kind of been in like a normal work week. Um, and so I thought it would be a good time to vlog again. Um, and there's just nothing special going on right now. Like I have been working in my pajamas <laughs> literally all week. Yeah, I think I'm just going to try and film maybe the next couple weeks and see what we can put together but yeah i have to day off because i've just been working like literally every weekend at like these events and things so today i am doing some filming i've thankfully had a lot of like personal social media stuff to do um i don't talk about it a lot much anymore just because work is so busy but I also do like UGC videos for brands. I have a couple videos to film today. 15 to 20 seconds. Maximize your marketing budget with boutique agency. Babe, I'm gonna need you to not laugh at me for the next half hour. I'll do my best. <laughs> it's gonna make this take way longer than it should. Hey marketers, budgets can be really stressful, but recently I found that outsourcing to boutique agencies is a great way to maximize your marketing spend. I actually don't feel that great today. I think all the traveling, um, like back to back I've been doing and just like stress is wearing on me a little bit. My boss sent over pho to be delivered. How nice is that? So I did bully Alec into walking to the park with me and enjoying the sunshine because it's such a nice day. It's a little chilly, but it's such a nice day. And we brought some cards, so we're gonna play some cards. Oh, you won. <laughs> I got excited. Oh, on my cup they wrote Sam. But on Alex's cup they wrote Jam. 
I've never been called jam before. I guess I could be a jam. Yeah, let me see. Oh, he said he read jam. They didn't give the S enough at the top. <laughs> So right as we were leaving, um, the mailman, the UPS guy was here with a package. I have been using Merit products literally since like probably like two and a half years ago. I am just obsessed. They have such good products. That it's a clean beauty brand, which I love. It's like minimal minimalist makeup. I'm obsessed with these flush bombs. They're blushes. Like they are literally so good. I don't have their makeup bag with me right now, but I think it's your first order over $40, you get a free little makeup bag. You can shop Merit products through the link in my bio. I have a link there um, and I can link these products that I got. This is in the color, um, what color is this one? Beverly Hills. I've never tried this one, but it's really nice. Just like an everyday like natural color. And then this is their shade slick in jelly, jelly tinted lip oil. I haven't tried this before i have one of their lip glosses but not the tinted lip oil and their stuff lasts me a long time i still have blushes that they sent me like literally back in like i think it was 2021 and i've been using them even though i probably should throw them away but i have like four colors of the blushes and i also have their bronzer i have a couple lip glosses i've had their eyebrow gel i've had their mascara i have their like complexion stick it's like a concealer and a foundation stick and they are the best. So yeah, you can shop Merit products through the link in my bio. Um, and your first order, you get the little free makeup bag tote. Over $40, you get free shipping, I believe. So yeah, check them out, I highly recommend. Um, so of course we are wasting time in a thrift store. So we went to a wedding last night and now we are in like the um, Palm Desert, like Indio Coachella area um, and we are actually going to go tour a wedding venue um, while we're out here and of course we stopped at Goodwill because um, we needed to waste time our um, tours until 12.30 and it's still barely 12. So yeah, we got breakfast and now we are on our way to the venue and this is really exciting. Um, I'm doing something very exciting today and I am going wedding dress shopping. It is super, super early to be going wedding shopping. Ideally, we will be getting married um, in the fall of 2024 and it's spring 2023. So we are a little bit ahead of schedule, but a boutique in San Diego invited me to come out and look at some dresses. And so today worked for both of us. Yeah, we will be doing that today. My mom's on her way. We're going to Grace Loves Lace in San Diego. I'm super excited. I'll show you guys my outfit that I threw together. I'm just wearing some little white slacks in this white top, a belt, some heels, and this bag. I'm kind of going with like a, a white and brown theme. We are going in a couple hours, but I just wanted to kind of get ready so I could have time to crank out the work day because it is a Monday and I still have to work. Today, I am having to reshoot some content that I'm working on for a brand. Mm. I think I, wait, can you, can you say hi one more time? Hi. <laughs> what we are running, so. Um, okay. Okay. 
because I had to, I updated that just today. Apologies for that. Like, no, no worries. Oh um, so I've just been chilling on the couch for a little bit, but my friend came and dropped off all of our stuff for our engagement party it's in like two weeks. Um, but her mom had a bunch of tables for us. We're having an engagement party at her house. And so she dropped off a bunch of the stuff that we're borrowing. And so I'm so excited. Um, we are having a garden party, engagement party. Yeah, and we are gonna be DIYing like all the decorations. And so I've been thrifting like glasses and stuff to put candles and flowers in. Um, yeah, and we're gonna decorate our backyard. It's gonna be so cute. But now I am just sitting down and getting some work done, which is so weird. But I am an eye owl. And I do better performing at night. <laughs> it's Friday and I am so excited for the weekend. I don't talk that much anymore about like what the actual things I'm doing when I'm typing away <laughs> um so i can just kind of go through my to-do list for the day and some things that i've gotten done so on my to-do list i wanted to send an email to part of our newsletter list so i did get that out i edited it earlier this week and then i just scheduled it and i had to make one more tweak this morning to an email and then i sent it to part of our newsletter yeah so that's done and then i had two calls this morning i had a call about a company reaching out to us they want to see if they can help us with like our advertising efforts and then i had another call with a platform that we want to start utilizing to help like our retention efforts um and just try and like get higher conversion rates um from our customers if that means anything to you guys it's kind of boring but yeah i had a call with them and then i need to make a wholesale email my coworker asked me to make one and send to our wholesale list like i have them segmented into their own list so i can send them like emails that pertain to like wholesale business um, so i need to do that and then something else i need to do is i need to finish up a new product um aesthetic brief we have some new launches coming up this year and so i am like working on a system of creating like an aesthetic for those products so that we know how to shoot them where to shoot them how to like style them and how to talk to our customers about them so i need to finish up those briefs i also need to go through a creative brief that our marketing agency sent to me for some new ad concepts um they send me like the concepts and then i respond back with the actual creative that goes into the ad so i need to do that that i will not finish today because there are like 10 ideas of content so it's like 10 pieces of creative that i cannot get done today yeah i think that's probably gonna how i'm gonna wrap up for today 